We've arrived here in McLean County. We're on site of the Rosie Fapiano 118 well. Drilling it to approximate depth of 13,000 feet. They're currently drilling at 9,700. The rig we're using is Beredco Rig 8. We're gonna spend a little time today going around talking about the components of this drilling rig and what goes into drilling a well here in the heart of oil and gas country in McLean County, Oklahoma. First thing we're gonna talk about today on the drilling rig is the mud system. It's the lifeblood of drilling an oil well. Um, behind me, we've got mud tanks, and to my left, we've got the generators running the mud pumps. The mud system in oil and gas is used for a myriad of reasons. They put it in here in the hopper, it gets mixed up into our mixing tank right outside, and then sent over to our reserve mud tanks. Uh, from there, it's gonna get pumped through the mud pumps and up to the rig and down the drill string and out the drill bit. That mud coming out the drill bit serves multiple functions. First of all, it cools the drill bit while we're drilling. It brings the cuttings to the surface. And third and probably most importantly, it keeps oil and gas or any hydrocarbons down in the earth from coming up to the surface. So your mud has to be in balance. And what I mean by balance is if your mud's too heavy, it'll go south into the hole and you'll lose mud. If the mud's too light, it'll allow reservoir fluids to come into the wellbore and come to the surface and you can have a really big disaster, catch rigs on fire, such like that. So mud is the most critical component of drilling an oil and gas well. If your mud's too thick, you'll drill slow. If your mud's too thin, it's not gonna cut, bring cuttings to the surface. They test their mud a few times a day. A mud engineer comes out in the morning and does a daily mud report and gives the recipe. There's 50, 60 different additives at least that you can add to plain water to make up what we call drilling mud. That engineer is gonna come out every morning, run his tests, and come up with a daily recipe and tell the rig hands what shape he wants the mud in and what they need to add and what stages um, to make a proper mud. So that's a little brief explanation of a mud system on a drilling rig, but really it is a lifeblood of drilling any oil well.